And it's going to create, sir, for Sons of America Legion Radio at the United States Air Force Academy, a 17-13 to 13 win by Air Force over Army, a game Army had a chance to win in the final minute, a first and goal at the Air Force seven-yard line, threw the ball three times, ran the ball once, but could not convert the opportunity. Uh, Air Force ran for 328 yards. Army passed for 214. They had an 87-yard touchdown play uh, from quarterback Jamari Laws to uh, wide receiver Cam Harrison, but it uh, was not enough. Let's watch some of the highlights uh, and pageantry of today's game here at the Air Force Academy. I always love to see Army beat Air Force. I love it. You saw it last time, a 21 to nothing uh, shutout. Yeah, I was here for that one, too. Let's have a chance to talk with old friend Sofer James, who's one of the officials that's out here. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Uh, it's a wonderful Army day, great Army weather. Uh, I'm president of the West Point Alumni Society, Pikes Peak Region. We're expecting about 1,700 people here at our tailgate. Everyone seems to be having a great time, ready for a big Army win. Thank you for making the choice to serve our nation. And now let's make it official. Raise your right hand. I say to you. Do solemnly swear that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States.
last drive? Uh, I mean, we had to move the ball. We didn't have much time, and Jabari Law stepped up, made some big big throws. We had a lot of people make some big catches, uh, just came up short. Yeah, the defense played well, gave up a couple big plays. All in all, I thought we fought, our, fought like hell, and we're ready to get back to work next week. Kelvin's been hurt, and, uh, and he's still injured, so uh, he didn't. You know, he went in there for that last drive, but we didn't feel like he was healthy enough to make it through an entire football game. And uh, Jabari had practiced, and, and Kelvin didn't, and uh, felt like he deserved the opportunity to, to play. And I thought he did a, did a good job. Always great to be able to show you the amazing uh, pageantry of college football at the service academies and these special games when uh, the academies play each other for the Commander-in-Chief Trophy. And we'll look forward to the Army-Navy game. Uh, Navy won their game this week, a big win over Connecticut. They really have revived their team over last year. Uh, great job by Coach Nia Matalolo and his team. Uh, and Malcolm Perry, their quarterback. So we'll, we'll see them in about a month. But business uh, for Army is take care of Massachusetts on Saturday. That'll be a big Veterans Day event at West Point. Uh, West Point Band's got a big halftime show, I know, and uh, they do a great job throughout. So uh, I'd like to thank our sponsors, the uh, Westchester Bank, the New York Yankees, the White Plains Bake Shop, Gedney Auto, and Westchester Family Chiropractic. If you'd like to join us as a partner, we'd sure love to hear from you. And always we say thank you to the 2 million veterans of the American Legion and our 350,000 members in the Sons of the American Legion. So from the Air Force Academy in Colorado Springs for Sons of the American Legion Radio, this is Ken Kreitzer.